माय नेम इज निहार रिसोडकर सो दिस इज आवर डीएमडब्ल्यू प्रोजेक्ट प्रॉब्लम स्टेटमेंट इज डायबिटीज प्रेडिक्शन यूजिंग रैपिड मैनर सो दिस इज द प्रोजेक्ट डन बाय फोर ग्रुप मेंबर दोज आर यश गोगावले रोल नंबर फोर वन टू टू फोर अथर्व जाधव रोल नंबर फोर वन टू टू सिक्स प्रणय जाधव रोल नंबर फोर वन टू टू सेवन निहार रिसवडकर रोल नंबर फोर वन टू सिक्स थ्री सो नाव आय विल टेल यू लिटल बिट अबाउट आर डेटा सेट या सो दिस इज द अवर डेटा सेट सो इट हॅज डिफरंट कन्स्टंट्स फर्स्ट इज प्रेगनन्सील नेक्स्ट इज ग्लुकोज थर्ड इज ब्लड प्रेशर देन स्किन थिकनेस देन इन्शुलिन बी एम आय अँड अँड एज सो युजिंग ऑल दिस कन्स्टंट वी आर गोईंग टू प्रेडिक्ट वेदर द पर्सन इज सफरिंग फ्रॉम डायबिटीज ऑर नॉट सो दॅट विल बी आर आउटकम इन द फॉर्म ऑफ वन ऑर झिरो Uh, so firstly uh, we have retrieved the data set so uh, we have retrieved the diabetes data set then in that uh, data set there uh, will be a few missing values uh, so uh, in whichever uh, column there are missing values then that particular value will be uh, by default we will put the average value of that column into the specific row then after that we will be converting uh, our output which is the outcome into from a numerical to binomial form uh, because uh, as uh, this is a classification type of a problem uh, uh, it will be converted from a numerical to a boolean type so in the sense uh, true or false or uh, um, things like that because uh, we will be using classification algorithms for it then uh, we will be performing the set role in the set role Uh, we have the attribute name outcome which we have put as the label which means that uh, the label uh, which is the what we are predicting is the label and that is the outcome in our case which is if the person is suffering from diabetes or not then we have performed cross validation so we have taken uh, 10 number of folds uh, for uh, it is 10 uh, fold cross validation first we will be splitting our data into a, a ratio of 70 and 30% which means that 70% of our data will be used for training purposes and 30% of our data will be used for testing purposes then uh, we will be uh, applying our we will be deciding uh, which algorithms we will be applying for our model so in this uh, project we have used four algorithms namely decision tree random forest logistic regression and naive based so using these four algorithms we will be applying them to our model and after applying we will be calculating the performance of each of the algorithm and depending on that we will uh, decide our outcome so uh, you can run uh, the project so after running we can see in the first performance vector we can we get an accuracy of 70.83% which is of a uh, uh, decision tree in the second one uh, we have used random forest uh, wherein we have gotten an accuracy of 74.61% the third one is the logistic regression which we have gotten an accuracy of 78.25% and the last one is the naive base which in which we have gotten the accuracy of 76.43%. So from this we can uh, conclude that uh, amongst all the machine learning algorithms uh, logistic regression gives us the best performance while uh, decision tree gives us the worst performance.